police are investigating following a spree of violence in Kensington. Five people were shot there in the past 24 hours. I want to see reporter Greg Argos is live at Philadelphia Police Headquarters with more on these incidents. Greg. And Jessica, that's exactly right. Philadelphia police sure have their hands full, especially in the Kensington neighborhood. Over the past 24 hours, five people have been shot, including the latest victim, a man we're told in his 40s shot in the head in a park in broad daylight. It has been a violent and deadly 24 hours in Philadelphia. The man just pulled up a gun and shot one time to the back of his head. The Kensington neighborhood being affected the most. <laughs> Wednesday late morning, police rushing to the scene here at 4th and Lehigh for the fifth person shot in 24 hours in Kensington. I got to be way more observant than I was before. Police say the victim in this latest shooting was selling toilet paper and other cosmetics at Fair Hill Square near 4th and Lehigh. When someone walked up to him and pulled a gun, witnesses say the victim ran, but he was shot in the back of the head, collapsing here near this fountain. He was rushed to Temple University Hospital at last check in critical condition. Nobody now wants to talk problems out or can't handle problems with their hands. They want to use firearms and that's ridiculous. It could have hit me. This latest shooting comes less than 24 hours and two miles from where three people were shot on East Thayer Street, including a pregnant woman in the belly. Oh. Hours after that shooting yesterday, another just blocks away. Same neighborhood, different victim, shot in the chest and back and pronounced dead at 5:45. This is the brotherly love, man. Where is it at though? It's not here. Where is it? Now, in this latest shooting, investigators have not yet released a motive, though police say it appears the suspect may have been trying to rob the victim in this last case just a few hours ago. That suspect, by the way, seen fleeing the scene in a late Monte Carlo sedan. We're live here at police headquarters. I'm Greg Argos, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Greg.